Knights. The Twins take it on the A's on Tuesday night as Liam Hendricks making his first home start this season. His opposition, Jared Parker, has not lost since May 22nd. But Parker finds trouble in the bottom of the second, and trouble's name is Josh Willingham. High blast to left center field. Chris back. Gone into the back bullpen. And Willingham hits his 13th to put the Twins in front. Minnesota with a 1-0 lead. Same score, top five until Alberto Callaspo tees off on Hendricks. That's a go-ahead two-run shot into right, and the A's take their first lead by a 2-1 tally. Top of the sixth, the A's looking for more. Hendricks in a two-on, one-out jam, facing Yoannis Cespedes as he laces the ribby single into left field. Josh Donaldson scores, and the A's have a two-run lead at 3-1. But as we go bottom six, the Twins are going to get one back. Oswaldo Arcia leads off the frame with the solo shot off Parker. And with one swing, the Twins cut the deficit in half. It's now three to two. That's where we stand in the bottom of the eighth. Back at the plate for Minnesota is Josh Willingham as he faces Ryan Cook with a man aboard. A high drive to deep left field. And Willingham puts the Twins in front. You kind of come back and uh, do some uh, ugly things against your former teammates and organization. Josh Willingham, a two-run home run. And for Ryan Cook, as you mentioned it, only the second home run he's allowed this year. 14th career multi-homer game for Willingham as the Twins take a 4-3 lead into the top of the ninth. And Glenn Perkins finishes things off. As he gets Nate Freiman on strikes to close out the game, save number 34 for Perkins as the Twins win it 4-3, snapping Oakland's winning streak at three and preventing them from stretching their lead over Texas in the AL West as the Rangers also lost. A no decision for Jared Parker, who stretches his unbeaten streak to 19 starts following six innings of two-run ball.